right hey 2024 tgma what a spectacular show this is awesome i think ghana as a as an entertainment industry we are doing so well every year we keep on improving and i was mesmerized by the show um but hey i'm here to talk about a little bit key points of um some artists and not all of the show most artists did great job like i said it was a wonderful show we enjoyed ourselves but i have a little keynote here um on certain artists and we're gonna start with stone boy because guess what he's number one stone boy uh, man he is he this man just oozes excellence he oozes excellence his his show performance it, it was as if he was he was performing in the united states or europe it shows how dedicated he is with his work um how he loves his work how he loves his country it was amazing um the only thing that i could maybe perhaps um seen a little bit more is um during your performance there was this soloist that was doing a ballet dance and you know i was hoping that you would interact a little bit i'm sure dr louisa is not going to have any issues with it if you interact a little bit when you have a soloist dancer behind you um that's the only thing that i think was missing a little bit and i've seen that most most of your shows but on the whole stone boys performance was absolutely stunning it was wonderful it shows hard work it shows excellence and um, I've seen other artists um, who performs in Ghana and is, is as if they never rehearse but um, Stone Boy did put more work much effort into his um, his performance and that's why currently he's the one in Ghana on the map as far as entertainment is concerned guess what he's the artist of the year he a well-deserved award now let's talk about the second greatest performance which is nasi what an awesome way to exalt or to reverence god come on hold it my name is nasi The whole entry of his band was spectacular. It was wonderful. I mean, the dancers were on point, on core with ev whatever words that he was saying, they were on point with the expressive dance. And um, one of the beautiful things that he did with, with, his, um, with his song, Asada. You know, he, he, he brought it from, he, he added a little flair from a Sada High Life to a trap song, rap kind of style way. It was funky, man. I, I just love that arrangement. So big, big ups to you, Nazi. The third greatest performer is Mr. Drew. I know you all know that he's he's a dancer. I just like it for the fact that he's able to be in sync with his dancers. Yes, we know he's... He used to be a dancer before he became um, a musician, but um, the way his energy on stage, his stage pre presence is very captivating. He is in sync with his um, with his dancers, and I think that places him um, or uh, that places him number three in my books. Kudos to you, Mr. Mr. Drew. That was a lovely performance. Love it. Love it. Love it. The fourth greatest performer is Eno Barani, man. Olija knows how I win the fight. Olija knows how I live my life. And Olija knows when I could die. Girl can spit on this mic. I mean, when it comes to female rappers in Ghana, Eno Barani is number one. I mean, this girl can spit on this mic. She is just good. I can say that she stole this the show from Akwabwa when during the legendary Amachi De Day's tribute. It was awesome. It was fantastic. I just I just love Eno's whole demeanor. I mean, it's, she comes so serious with her rap, but at the end of the day, it's also entertaining at the same time. Kudos to you. I love your show. I love your performance. Who loved me? Some can promise. <laughs> 
Yeah, when you have me here, I'm talking about the And in my CCTV, they be an anyone, I'm so So make you do your best, and you just answer yeah. I've shown the stress since I broke up first I'll let you know be real, and know be test, yeah Oh, man So, all right, listen I love me, Kim Promise His entry was awesome was wonderful it was going so well with your namibia and then a little bit when he was about to change it to his latest song oh boy yeah 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 oh, i've been here before so it looks like the band was trying to find his key somewhere i don't know maybe um he left it in the water and it took the bands like many years to eventually find the keys but hey i don't know what else he could have done you know for him also to find his key but that little um transition it was poor it it, it, it was not good at all so um next time let's watch that okay kim promise and um so that we can find your key hopefully well you did find it you did find it eventually it took forever for, for you to find it the creme of la creme what's so come the goo what's so what's so here the goo what's so what's so way now on tv that hey what's your me family fans I love me some rap doctor. I just love a charm requirement. There were so many things that went wrong with Ochame's performance. Man, Ochame, you've you've been doing this for a long time. I don't know why you decided to do miming and then at, at some point, you know, you you forgot your your words, your own song, you know, you were not able to to coordinate it with, with the miming. The miming was like here and then you were beginning from here. <laughs> So um, that that was not the rap doctor that I have experienced or I know. So uh, thumbs thumbs down. <laughs> you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. But oops, <laughs> he was not able to do it. I I feel like his his ornament around his neck the crown on his head if you know that you're going to do whether it was a back flip or what kind of flip that he was trying to do those those ornaments were were very dis destructive there was no way that you know you could have flipped back and then still had your ornament with you unless you know you are a professional trainer and in uh, um, um, acrobatics and you've been doing it for a long time or you've been rehearsing for a while and you're able to hold all the ornaments that is around you thank god that you didn't i mean hurt yourself but i just like it at the end you know his crown after you can do it you can do it and eventually wasn't able to do it but you know the people around him they were able to put back his crown on so hey Ochame Kwame, better luck next time hey i hope you had a fun time watching this thank you for sticking with me um as you know this is nana frima tv if you haven't already um subscribe go ahead and hit that button below if you have subscribed thank you for watching toodles